Hello guys, in this video I'm just going to explain how to add more than one controller to play EA Sports FC24. I'm going to add more than one controller. You can add up to four controllers. So that's what I'm going to explain. So if you want to play one on one right, you can play on FC24. So in order to connect right on your PS4 console, what you need to do is you need to go to this uh, kickoff first. Choose kickoff. So you can see the controller here. Also you can change the settings, change controller method. If you just want to use alternate or you can choose two button one button classic so right now i'm going to choose classic and you need to move this primary player to left side okay left side or right side you can choose home or away so i'm going to choose home and then if you want to create the name right you can create a new kickoff name you can enter that already i have a name so i'm going to select this existing just tap X, it's ready. So this controller is ready. So I'm going to add the second controller. Take the second controller and the USB wire. So I'm going to connect. It will be very easy if you're using wire or you, if you have already connected the controller through Bluetooth, just press this PS button. But I'm going to connect it first time. So I'm connecting the other end to this PS4 console. It's connected. So I'm going to press this PS button. So here, right, you can choose existing user if you have already logged in otherwise you can choose new user and if you want to play as a guest you can just add it usually i will do play as a guest here i'm going to choose do not sign in super cool the second controller also has been added now you can choose this second player to home or away so i'm going to choose away and there is no kickoff name so i need to create it Create new kickoff name and choosing a, a something. Okay, selecting it. So the name should be created here. And this controller also is ready. Now I am removing this USB cable. So second controller light bar is red. The first player is blue and second is red. So now two players can play. So you need to tap at once. This user also should tap X button to move to the match. Now you can start any of these matches. Right now I'm going back because I'm going to add the third controller as well. This time I'm going to directly press this PS button because this controller is already connected to the console. You need not to have wire. If you are connecting first time, you can add wire. So it's changed. You can select existing user. So tapping X. I need to create a new kickoff name. Or I can select because already logged in, right? So now third player also is ready. So, so far I have connected three controllers. I'm going to connect the fourth one. It's the same thing. You can use wire. If you're connecting first time, you can use the wire. Otherwise, you can directly press the PS button if you have already connected to the console so i'm going to press this ps button so this time i'm going to choose new user and play as a guest if you want to sign in you can sign in but i'm going to choose this do not sign in the fourth one i'm moving to away so i need to create a new kickoff name and select it So now four players has been added so that you can see first player. So four player has been added here. So everyone should be ready and then tap at once. So it started initializing. So now you can start the match. So I'm going to choose this classic match. So you can change the country. Okay, cool. So the group leader should accept. Okay. Then play the match. See, so both the player can play. So that's it friends. This is the way you can connect up to four controllers. Okay, or you can play one on one in EA Sports FC24. So this is the way you need to connect it.
So hope this video is very much helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Please put a comments and feedbacks in media forms. Thank you. Bye and take care.